Hi, hello children. How are you all? Welcome back to my class. Today in this class, we are going to continue our same lesson of maths from your textbook part 2. Okay. So, mental arithmetic. So, open page number 21. So, children, here it is there. Chapter, chapter number 3, mental arithmetic, which is there on page number 21. Right. So, in this lesson, we have solved first main, second main from exercise 3.1, right? So, today in this class, we are going to solve the third main, yes? So, let's start. Estimate sum of the following by rounding off to nearest thousands place, right? So, here already we know how to round off to the nearest thousands place that we have done in the first main right the same thing we have to do here there is one more new word is there that is estimate sum okay so what is this estimate sum will understand by taking the first example so let's take this first example here 42,125 plus 35,637 so i'll write the same example here here it is there. What we will do first, we will round off the nearest thousands place. Okay. We will round off these numbers to the uh, nearest thousand place. So, you know how to do it. Right. Already we have done it. So, we will see the first number here. 42,125. What will the rounding number, rounding number of this number? Can you tell me? Yes. If the digit at 100 place is... 1, 2, 3 or 4 replace the unit 10, 100 by 0. Right. So, here in the place of 100 we are having what? We are having 1 means you have to replace this unit 10, 100 by 0. Then you have to keep this number as it is that is in the 1000 place. Right. So, we will write here that is 42,000. Okay. This is how we have to round off. Right. So, then plus here we are having plus. So, now we have to round it up this number. So, you can see what you have to do. We have to see the digit in a 100 place. If the digit in the 100 place is 5, 6, 7, 8 or 9. Then you have to replace this unit 10, 100 by 0. Then you have to add 1 to the 1000 place here. Right. So, if you do it like this 0, 0, 0. Then you have to add 1. Means 5 plus 1 is 6 and this 3 will remain as it is. Okay. You have to keep this number unchanged. So, here we have rounded off these both the numbers. So, here it has become 42,000 and here it is a 36,000. Okay. So, this is how we have to round it of the numbers. Now, we have to calculate the estimated sum of these numbers, right? So, what is this estimate means? What do you mean by estimation means? So, see here, in this example, here we are having 42,125 and here 35,637. So, here in this case, what is that a rounded off number that is 42,000 and here it is a 36,000 right so this 42,000 and 36,000 are almost the same as the exact numbers right so but they are not exact they are almost the exact but they are not exact numbers so these are approximated numbers okay these are called approximated numbers the approximate number is roughly calculated so, this approximate calculation is called as a estimation. Okay. So, how we have to do the estimated sum? So, we have to take down these numbers here. That is 42,000 plus same that is 36,000. Okay. So, let's add it. We are having the plus sign here. So, 0 plus 0, 0. 0 plus 0, 0. 0 plus 0, 0. 0, plus 0, 0. And here... 2 plus 6 is how much? It is 8. And 4 plus 3 is how much? It is 7. So, this is our estimated sum. So, I'll write here estimated sum. Okay. So, this is our estimated sum. So, let's put the comma here. So, it will become what? It is 78,000. Right. So, uh, we can verify it by actual addition. Okay. How it is? 
so we have to take the numbers that the numbers which is there in the i mean that in the example okay so we'll take that 40 2125 plus 35000 yes 637 so let's add these numbers to verify by actual addition so this is called the actual addition and this is the estimated sum okay so here 5 plus 7 5 plus 7 is how much it is 12 right so we'll write 2 here and we'll carry over to the next place now 1 plus 2 is how much 3 3 plus 3 is that is 6 right next 1 plus 6 is 7 next 2 plus 5 is how much it is again 7 4 plus 3 is how much it is 7 right so let's put the comma now will you read this number here that is 77762 right so rounding of the number to the nearest thousand place so let's do it so here you know what is the condition right so here it is 7 means what we have to add 1 to this thousand place first we have to replace this unit 10 and 100 by 0 so 0 0 0 and here you have to add 1 means 7 plus 1 is 8 and this 7 as it is and let's put the comma what is our answer that is 78000 so this is by the actual addition and here it is by the estimated sum so we got the same answer right so this is a verification method only so this is our answer what is our answer that is 78000 is that clear yes now let's move to the second one Yes, so children, can you say this one? So, first one we have solved and here we are having second one. That is 54,837 plus 41,354. Okay, so already we have written this number here. So, here you can see, right? So, first what we have to do? We have to round off these both the numbers to nearest thousand place. Okay, first we'll do this one. 54,837. So, you just round off this number and tell me the answer, children. Yes, it is 55,000 because at the 100 place, we are having what? We are having 8. Means, we have to replace this unit 10, 100 by 0. Then, we have to add 1 to the number which is there at 1000 place, right? So, it will become what? 55. So, 55,000 let's put the comma plus right so again here now you have to see this number which is there at 100 place so it is 3 is there means if the digit at if the digit at 100 place is 1 2 3 4 what you have to do in this case we have to we have to replace this unit 10 100 by 0 and we have to keep this number which is there on 1000 place unchanged right so means it is it will become as it is that is 41 thousand zero 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 let's put the comma this is how we have to round off the numbers to the nearest thousand place right so next what you have to do you have to add these numbers to get the estimated sum yes so we'll write here that is 55,000 plus 41,000 so let's add it 0 plus 0, 0, 0 plus 0, 0, 0 plus 0, 0, 5 plus 1, 6, 5 plus 4 is how much? It is 9. So, let's put the comma. You know how to put the comma, right? Yes. So, what is our answer? What is our estimated sum? Yes, our estimated sum is 96,000. So, shall we verify it? Yes. So, here what you have to do? You have to write the actual numbers here. What is that? That is 50, 54,837 plus 41,354. So, let's add these numbers. 7 plus 4 is how much? It's 11, right? So, one will write here and the next one will carry over to the next place. So, next one. 3 plus 5 is how much? 8, right? 8 plus 1 is? That is 9. Right, next, 8 plus 3. 8 plus 3 is how much? 11, right? So, here we'll write 1 and the next one will carry over to the next place. 4 plus 1 is 5. 5 plus 1 is 6. Next, 5 plus 4 is how much? 5 plus 4 is 9, right? Let's put the comma. So, what is our answer here? 
that is 96,191, right? So, this is the actual addition. After getting this answer, what we have to do? We have to round off this number. We have to round off this number to the nearest thousand place, okay? Let's do it. What we have to do? We have to see the first number which is there at a hundred place. If it is 1, 2, 3, 4, then you have to replace unit 10, 100 by 0 and you have to keep this number unchanged. Means the number which is there at thousand place. So, here 0, 0, 0 and this is 96 as it is. So, what is our answer after rounding of this? Yes, we got 96,000. So, this is the rounded of 96,191. So, here also we got the answer that is estimated sum was 96,000 and here also it is 96,000 means it is the right answer. Is that clear children? Yes. Now, we will move to the next, the third one. So, yes children, we have solved first and second one. Now, we are having the third one that is 33,231 plus 20,097. Okay. So, here I have written that same number. Yes. So, here it is there. First, what we have to do? We have to round off these both the numbers to the nearest thousand place. Okay. Let's do it. Here, what you have to see? We have to see the number which is there at hundred place. If it is one, two, three, four, we have, we have to do. We have to, yes, we have to replace unit 10, 100 by 0. Then, we have to keep the number which is there at thousand place unchanged. Okay. Yes. So, it is 33,000. Right. Plus, next, you only have to tell me now, what will the answer after rounded off to the nearest thousand place? Yes, yes, very good, it is 20,000, right? But what you have to do, you have to do the estimated sum of this. So, we will take this here, the, num the rounded off numbers, that is 33,000 plus that is 20,000, right? Yes, so let's add it. 0 plus 0 is 0. 0 plus 0 is 0. 0 plus 0 is 0. 3 plus 0 is 3. 3 plus 2 is that is 5. So it is 53,000. What is this? That is the estimated sum, right? Yes, so let's verify it. To verify which number we have to take, we have to take the actual numbers. That is 33,231 plus 20,097, right? Yes. So, let's add both the numbers here. 33,231 plus that is 20,097. So, let's add this number. 1 plus 7 is how much? It is 8. 9 plus 3 is how much? It is 12, right? So, we'll write 2 here and 1 will carry over to the next place. Here, 2 plus 0 is 2, 2 plus 1 is 3, right? Next, 3 plus 0 is 3, 3 plus 2 is, that is 5. So, let's put the comma. So, what is our answer? After addition, that is 53,328. Now, what you have to do? We have to round off these numbers to the nearest thousand place, right? So, let's do it. You have to tell me the answer now. Yes, children? Yes, it is. 53,000. Okay, you have to see this number which is there at the 100 place. If it is 1, 2, 3, 4, then you have to replace this unit 10, 100 by 0. Then you have to keep this number. Means the number which is there at 1000 place unchanged. So, here that is 53,000, right? So, if you see the both the answer, they are both are the same. So, means the answer which you have estimated that is the correct okay now let's move to the fourth one and the last one yes so children here it is there the fourth one that 47,463 plus 41,541 so children here what we will do you just pause the video and try to solve it by yourself later you continue the video and just check your answer with my answer. If it is correct, very good children. And if you have done any of the mistake, it's okay. You try to solve it once again. Later, you will solve it properly. Okay. So, let's do. So, here is your answer. That is 89,000. And after verification also, you got 89,000. So, it is 
the last answer that is 47,463 plus 41,541. So hope you all have done it correctly. Very good children. And if you are not done, it's okay. Try to solve it once again. Okay. So children, in today's class, we have solved the third main from exercise 3.1. In the next class, we will go with the fourth main. So till then, take care of yourself. Be with me. And uh, uh, the class, whatever we have done on this lesson, you will get that video's link in my description box. Go and check it out there. And uh, if you think this video is really useful to you, then don't forget to like, share and do subscribe my channel. So, bye-bye.